Paclitaxel, known for its high effectiveness and low toxicity, is a widely utilized natural anti-cancer drug with broad-spectrum applications. Paclitaxel stabilizes microtubules by amplifying the binding of microtubule protein dimers and organizing their depolymerization, thereby inhibiting the normal dynamic reorganization of microtubules. This process leads to cell cycle arrest at the G2M phase, impeding tumor cell replication, and ultimately inducing apoptosis. Paclitaxel also has the ability to trigger a variety of signaling pathways, with its action mechanism seemingly related to the initiation of proapoptotic signals. However, with prolonged clinical use, the inevitable occurrence of paclitaxel resistance hampers the progress of cancer treatment, Gaining a better understanding of the molecular mechanisms that underlying the reversal of resistance, in conjunction with enhancing drug efficacy, is of paramount importance for optimizing resistance prevention or reversal. Wuxi Biology has established gastric cancer HGC27 and breast cancer HCC1806 cell lines that are stably resistant to paclitaxel. We have also established corresponding in vivo tumor models for these two resistant cell lines. The paclitaxel R HGC27 cell line was derived from parental HGC27 cells via long-term in vitro drug treatment. In vitro cell titer glow assay demonstrated that paclitaxel R HGC27 possesses a pronounced paclitaxel resistant phenotype compared to parental HGC27. Subsequently, paclitaxel resistant cells were subcutaneously xenografted into immunodeficient mice, exhibiting a certain degree of resistance to both 15 and 30 mg per kilogram dosages of paclitaxel compared to parental HGC27 cells. Recent studies indicate that members of the AVP binding cassette transporter protein family can facilitate drug efflux, promoting an increased expulsion of various anti-cancer drugs from tumor cells. Consequently, the upregulation of expression and activity of ABC transporter proteins represent a classical mechanism of chemotherapeutic resistance. Flow cytometry analysis of paclitaxel R HGC27 cells showed upregulation in ABCB1 and ABCG2 proteins. Paclitaxel R HCC1806 was obtained through long term drug induction in HCC1806 bearing mice. When a resistant phenotype was observed, the tumor tissue was harvested and subsequently processed into single cells in vitro. It showed resistance to paclitaxel compared to parental HCC1806. Following this, paclitaxel resistant cells were xenografted into immunodeficient mice and treated with 25 mg per kilogram paclitaxel, showing significant resistance compared to parental cells.